How quickly can you deploy an IAM solution for your organization? Well, Sunnivate can deploy IAM solutions in a matter of minutes. And here's a quick demonstration for the Sunnivate's Glue server with a fully automated script. So right now, I've logged into the ESXi console, and I'm spinning up the new CentOS server for the Glue deployment. We have our own automated script that will deploy Glue servers in any environment and at any time. As you can see, the Glue server deployed using a fully automated script, which is then going to deploy the IAM solutions for any organization who's looking for an IAM, and it's almost done now. So here, all the configurations and the components have been stored inside the Glue server. Now, let me check to confirm whether the installation is successful and if all the necessary configurations have been completed successfully. You can see here that all the information over here and also all the components are installed. Now I'm signing out. And the best part of this demo is that Senovate can deploy IAM solutions in no time. I've logged into Glue, so let me check the server again. The setup and error log are placed inside the glue container. So now we need to check if there are any errors within the installation. If the customer wants to deploy IAM solutions within the organization, then Senovate has a unique deploying solution that can be achieved by automation. So everything looks good here, and let me log into the glue container. If you don't know, glue is one of the global open source IAM tools that customers use. And all the components have been created successfully, and you can see that all the permissions have been set. The integration starts here, so everything has been done successfully. Now let's go back and see the error log for any installation errors. There are no warnings or signs of error here, so everything seems to be perfect. So the URL is up and I can log into the Glue server as an admin user. So there you go, your Glue server is up and running. We can also see that the IP address of the CentOS and other configurations look good. So we can move on to integrating the Active Directory with the Glue server. Uh, I don't want to use other sources of authentication. So instead we can configure AD as source of truth for Glue authentication.
I'm logging into my AD as domain user. So basically now I want to get the bind variable for the admin user so that I can link my glue server with the active directory. The bind variable needs to be configured in glue server to bind with the AD.